been in business for over 40 years. We want to bring our technology and some new technology, innovative technology, to the uh, UTV and the power sports marketplace. Well, we challenge our engineering group to always take it to the next level and to do something different. And uh, what I've researched this industry, we, we found that there hasn't been a lot of change. And so what we wanted to do is, is we wanted to get into the UTV marketplace, but we wanted to do something great. We just didn't want to come in with a, uh, another Me Too, although we would do it better than just uh, the rest of our competitors. We think we would at least. Um, however, we wanted to come in and make a real bang and come out with a product that, that the industry didn't uh, want to have, but they had to have. And I think we created that. This unit is called the SMB Particle Separator, and it works with your stock system. So there's a lot of people out there that don't want to uh, give up their stock system. They're concerned for whatever reason that may be, and, and we wanted to make something that will work with the stock system. And so what we did is we created a particle separator, and what happens is uh, this mounts on top of the roll bar, and uh, the dirty air comes in through uh, vortexes, and these vortexes spin the dust. And as the dust is spent, when you spin the dust, it goes to the outer walls and it is ejected out the exhaust. There's a scavenge fan in here, as you can see right here. And that scavenge fan sucks out the dust and shoots it out the, uh, the exhaust and to the rate of 94%. So 94% of the dirty air, the dust that comes in the vortexes, is separated out and shot out the exhaust with the clean air continuing forward uh, to the filter itself. One of the biggest problems with the UTV industry is that um, there's a lot of dust where they're, where they're driving and the filters get clogged very quickly. And what we wanted to do was something a little different. We usually just do air intakes and air filters, but we wanted to actually separate the dust out of the air before it even gets to the filter. And we looked at a lot of different technologies um, we looked into cyclonic separation uh, in a lot of different industries from, you know, big dust separators for, like, agricultural use to what's going on inside, like, modern vacuum cleaners. We did a lot of different testing and finally experimented with something that we were very happy with as far as its separation performance and percentage. And uh, we took that technology and put it into a package where you get a complete system that bolts onto the vehicle and uh, basically is completely plug and play. One of the things that UTV racers are concerned about is power, obviously, and as their filter gets clogged, it restricts their airflow, and that obviously will cost them horsepower. So, what a racer might be concerned with is if they put this system in front of their factory or whatever intake they have, um, is it going to restrict airflow from the get-go? And the answer is no. We did dyno testing on a super flow chassis dyno and the horsepower and torque curves pretty much line up with each other. And the good thing is as you, as you use this, you're not going to see a, a decrease in, in horsepower because it's keeping your intake clean and the dust is getting shot out the exhaust. It's not going to clog your air filter and it's not going to clog anything in here. So it, it keeps you going for, for longer and it maintains your performance and horsepower. A key component of our particle separator is what we call our scavenge fan and what the scavenge fan does is it, as the vortexes spin the dust, the dust, the dirty air goes through the vortexes and as the vortexes spin the dust and it exits this hole right here, the part of, that's where our scavenge fan comes into play and what that does is a scavenge fan runs at close to 200 CFM and it sucks the dust and shoots it out the exhaust. And uh, this isn't just a normal computer fan, this, this fan is highly rated, it's called, it has an IP rating and uh, it'll last 50,000 hours in extreme conditions, dust, water, etc. So, uh, our, our particle separator, first, as we, were, we mentioned earlier, the dirty air comes in the vortexes where it spins the dirt and it exits this hole right here. But a key component of our particle separator is our IP rated fan. And what this means is this fan spec to run in harsh conditions, dust, uh, rain, if you have snow, whatever it may be, under harsh conditions for 50,000 hours. And so what I'm gonna do is just show you how it works. It's not made to run underwater, but what I'm going to show you is I'm going to plug it in 
and immerse it in water and it's going to stop. And then after it stops, I'm going to take it back out and it will continue to run. So again, it's not meant to propel water, so it will stop. However, when you take it back out, it will continue to run. So what I'm going to do here is plug it in. It stopped running. Take it out. And you can see it power back on. So again, it's not made to run underwater. However, when it gets wet, it's going to take those harsh conditions, any kind of harsh conditions that you can throw at it in your UTV.